and talk to me about uh, what you guys are doing. I'm a video blogger and I'm interested in what you guys are doing today. Uh, we're, um, protesting the, we're protesting Alexei Julius' involvement in the loss of $83 million in the Rice Star College Fund. Um, the College Fund was this, is a government program set up by the state of Illinois designed primarily to help people help them to go to university. And um, when Alexei Julius was treasurer after his election in 2006, he um, managed to lose $83 million worth of money in the College Fund, a large portion of which was lost in the 2008 recession. However, a sizable number as well was lost afterwards and before. Okay, uh, my name is John Sheehan and my uh, YouTube uh, blog is Dogstar7. Uh, could you tell me who you are and, and what your affiliation is here? Uh, my name is Aaron. I'm just a volunteer. I'm just a volunteer here. I like. I came here to protest. Oh, you're a volunteer for whom? I'm just a, no a volunteer for the protest. I just came to for protest. For the protest. I came to protest. I see. So you're a volunteer for the uh, Republican Party? The Illinois Republican Party? The signs are printed by them, but no, I'm an independent. Hey, you're a student? I am, yes. And what's your uh, your connection to the college fund that you're talking about? Um, well, I've heard, I know several of my friends actually got into college based on the fund. And what happened is, they're, they're not affected now, but some of their younger siblings have been, and some of their, um, some of their friends have been affected as well. And you weren't? I was not, no. So, so you you haven't availed yourself of this college fund? I have not. I, How much more can you tell me about it firsthand? Though? Firsthand, I can tell you that it's been I can tell you it's been rather successful, um, primarily because of the large amount of money put in, which has allowed many students to go to college. However, the loss of money is threatening to cut the program's effectiveness greatly. I can't give an exact percentage, though, unfortunately. But, well, well, why why was the, con the, the fund cut? The fund was cut because of poor investment in the market, which is where primary, which is where a lot of these funds were distributed. The funds, I don't know exact funding structure of the scheme, but the funding, but I'd imagine most of it was invested invested in the stock market or in bonds. Bonds, of course, take a, bonds, of course, mature after a long while, whereas the stock market has been rather tumultuous lately. And again, getting back to Alexei Janulius, pardon this. Alexei Janulius is the state treasurer, and it's his responsibility to invest the money properly in order to ensure profit to allow more students to go to college. What could have been done better? Um, he could have made better investments, I believe. I think that the 2008 recession is was unfortunate, and that affected all of us horribly. It affected me personally, it affected my family, it affected a lot of people I know. And you're, you and your family and everyone else wouldn't, weren't able to get beat out of the way of it, but you expect that Alexei Janulia should have. I believe that, a lot, I think that after, a large number of, the, a large amount of the money was lost after the 2008 recession had ended, or after the worst part of it had ended, and some of it was lost before. Okay, then why weren't we talking about that before? Oh, pardon me, I thought I was. Okay. Um, well, the recession caused a, caused a loss of some of the money. However, a no large portion of it was lost not during the not during the recession through poor investment. You know me, I'm always about and <laughs> such as such as I such as a large por large portions of it invested in com in companies that were in volatile markets. Um, I don't exactly know which companies precisely, but I know a lot, some portions of it invested in, for example, the digital markets, which suffered a great downturn before, both before and after the recession hit. Mm -hmm. And some of it were invested in more traditional industries, uh, which haven't been doing well, period. Well, I understand that, I mean, you know, I, I'm not asking for specific, uh, you know, companies that were invested in. It seems that you have a lot of general knowledge about this. How did you come up by come come by this knowledge? I came by this knowledge through the course of through the course of my independent study. I enjoy independent studies. Yes. How, yeah. How how were you directed in an independent study? Oh, I I browse. I go to the bookstore a lot. Quite honestly, that's usually how I get most of my knowledge. I read the paper. I read papers. I read the Sun Times. I read the Tribune. I read New York Times. I read the Wall Street Journal. And you carry signs that are paid for by the Republican Party. Yes, I believe. Yes, this that's happening. Politicians and political parties have pro fun protests all the time. The world can't wait and the Communist Party are down the street from us right now. And it's very it's a very common practice. 
But, I mean, you claim to be an independent, though. I am a registered independent. A registered independent, yes. And you're carrying a sign that's paid for by the Republican Party. So... Yes, that's the simple oh, right, truth. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you very much for your time. You're welcome. Have a good day.